Hello, welcome to Local Edition. I'm Leslie Layton. She is the freshman representative on a 10-member GOP uh, House uh, Leadership Committee, and she's with us now to talk about what's going on in Washington, uh, the agenda to come. Welcome, Congresswoman Mimi Walters. Well, thanks for having me. It's great to be back. Um, so you have some new things going on. Uh, it's almost like being a freshman at high school. You're looking for your locker. You're looking for your way around. Exactly. I sort of joke saying, you know, I'm 52 years old and I'm a freshman again. And uh, my kids tease me because um, I have a freshman in college right now. And so we're sort of relating to what we're both going through. But you're managing to really see how things work on the inner side of uh, Washington. What have you witnessed so far that's really left a, a mark on your head? Well, um, it's been such a wonderful experience and, um, you know, being a member of the leadership team and having the ability to sit at the table and being able to speak with um, the leaders and voice concerns of the freshman class or let the freshman class know what leadership is thinking is really quite an honor and I feel like I'm a part of really helping move America forward. But you're entering at a time when the approval rating has never been lower for Congress, mm -hmm. so there's never been gridlock quite this bad. Do you Are you optimistic that things are gonna get done? I'm very optimistic. I mean, we um, were sent to Washington, D.C. by the voters. The Republicans took majority of the House. Well, we had the majority, but we took majority of the Senate. And I think the American public has spoken and said, you know, the president's policies aren't working for us. We want the Republicans to provide alternatives and solutions, and we want th them to put them on the president's desk, and that's exactly what we're doing. Okay, what's at the top of the agenda in this year? Currently, we just uh, passed Keystone Pipeline uh, legislation that's going to create, you know, thousands and thousands of jobs. The Senate just passed um, it last week. It's coming back to the House, and we will... Uh, pass it again and, and put the Senate's version um, legislation on the president's desk and then it's up to him to decide what he's going to do. Um, but uh, you know everyone says how they want to work together well you want to work together as long as the other side agrees with what you're doing I mean the president might not agree with uh, the proposal that you're submitting and uh, you don't necessarily agree with Obamacare so where do you get you, you know, have to find forward? compromise I mean, I think at the end of the day, we have to show the American public that we have solutions and our ideas is what the American public wants. And then, you know, we can only do, hope the president will work with us on it. What are some examples of actual progress that you feel you can make moving forward? Well, we have passed 27 pieces of legislation in 13 days of a legislative session. And that's actually quite um, a lot of legislation very early on in the session. We passed um, the 40-hour work week to reinstate the 40-hour work week, hoping um, the president will support that. We also uh, passed a piece of legislation that's going to allow businesses to um, hire uh, veterans, uh, make it easier for them. And I think the president probably would support something like that. We want to put our veterans back to work. Uh huh. Um, what uh, what do you feel you bring to Washington that you can make a difference there? Well, I'm a mom of four kids. Uh, I served for 10 years in the California State Legislature, so I have a pretty good basic foundation of how the system works. But having my children, um, being a mom of four, I'm used to being sort of the referee and having uh, to learn how to uh, solve problems. And I really want to make sure that our, our future generations have um, uh, a wonderful life in, in America. And that's really why uh, I ran for office. All right. Mimi Walter, so glad you could come in and check in with us. Um, best of luck to you. Thank you so much. Ahead. And thank you for joining us. I'm Leslie Lane.